I'd be lying to you if I said I didn't want to make a hit indie game because I absolutely do. And I don't want to do it for the money. Sure, if I made a game like Terraria or Stardew Valley that made millions of dollars, I would take the money and that would change my life. But the real reason is I simply want to prove that I can do it. I know it's dangerous and it might be stupid to make this my goal, but if I'm being completely honest with myself, in the last couple of years of learning to make games, releasing my first game, Chess Survivors, it's only grown as more and more of something that I just wanna prove that I can make a quote unquote hit indie game. And I'm not sure what that means. And frankly, saying this out loud to you actually scares me quite a bit. And I went back and forth on if I should release this video or not, but I know deep down in my heart that if I learn how to become a good enough indie developer, if I could become a good enough designer, developer, publisher, if I learn how to work with different companies to help me on those different tasks, that I can make a hit game. I just need to become courageous, get your help and feedback, and I know I can do it. I, I, I don't know why that's changed. I just know that it's, it's inside of me, and I need to be honest about those feelings. A couple weeks ago, I mentioned I started working on a new puzzle game, and well, in the last couple of weeks, my life has actually changed. And I'll make a whole video talking about exactly what those changes are and how they'll impact this channel. And with those new life changes, I've decided not to work on this game anymore. So instead, I'm gonna be making my dream game. It's gonna be combining some elements from Terraria, like mining and collecting resources, like in Potion Craft, where you have specific goals to create potions for your NPCs so you can earn more money and coins, so you can build more upgrades, or even all the way to Path of Exile, where instead of, in my game, instead of selling the items you craft, you can choose to use them yourself to go fight harder and harder bosses to go collect more rare resources so you can craft better items in my head it turns into this really cool progression based solo cave diving rpg vendor experience that i'm very excited now of course i will share all of the details in coming videos but that's a game I really want to play. It's a game I really want to make. It's a game that I think I could have an incredible scope that could go into early access. And then I could see myself doing patch after patch with feedback from you and my other players to make this game a really deep and enriching solo RPG experience that I just frankly, I want to play. And I'm getting excited thinking about it. So if you're getting excited as well, come join me over on Twitch. I'm gonna be live the couple hours after I first release this video. Come join me, twitch.com slash Aramis. If not, Leave, leave your thoughts down below in the comments or come join me over to my Discord. I've been Aramis. Until next time, have a great day.